is National Autism Acceptance Month, and the state is on a brand new endeavor this year. The Cade NOAA Act went into effect in January. It requires all law enforcement officers to go through sensory sensitivity or invisible disability training every other year. The Helena Police Department was the first in the state and the second in the country to get this training back in 2021. Chief Brad Flynn has a son with a rare genetic disorder that causes him to have sensory needs, so this is important for him both professionally and personally he tells me. Chief Flynn said after his department was certified, he brought Dr. Julian Maha with the nonprofit Culture City to a Chiefs Association meeting to teach other law enforcement officials about the training. The rest is history. He says Shelby County now leads the way in the state by having the most agencies on board with the new initiative. Being the parent of a special needs child, um, you want to know that if your child encounters law enforcement or any public safety people when you're not there, that they're going to be treated with respect and they're going to be treated um, like anybody else would. Now, sensory sensitivity bags that are in several vehicles in the Helena Police Department and the Shelby County Sheriff's Office have items such as sunglasses for light sensitivity, headphones for sound sensitivity, even fidget toys to help with those distractions. We have a more in-depth look at them right now on our WBRC News app.